Hi there, it's Peter here again, the guy who hates tomatoes but loves front-end development and who loves GreenSock. Okay, in today's very quick video update, I wanted to just let you know that I've published the new GreenSock cheat sheet and we'll quickly have a look what's inside of it. Alrighty, so the GreenSock cheat sheet is a simple PDF that I put together and I try to include all the commonly used GreenSock snippets, so you can just copy and paste it into your own project, modify it and save some time while doing some cool animations. So in the top left, you'll see how to create a variable, then how to create a simple tween when you're using the tween light. And then a few of the options covering below that in more detail, like the easing, how to pause it, delay, how to set the callback functions and how to set the tween from or tween from to. In the middle, you've got a timeline, uh, timeline light options. So how to create a timeline, how to add multiple tweens to it and few other playback options. Okay, on the right, we've got a timeline max. Again, how to set it, where are you setting the options and what the options are. This is not covering all of them, but the most commonly used are in here. And then at the end, tween max, again, covering what are the options and how to set more advanced options to your animations. Okay, at the end is a link to the GreenSock start guide. So if you if this is the first time you're coming across GreenSock, this is this is the best demo you can start with. Okay, in the top right, you've got links to all four of these plugins or four of these uh, libraries documentation. So feel free to jump into that for more details. But hopefully these one cheat sheet just helps you to find the most commonly used snippets more quickly and save you some time. Okay, if you've got any feedback or questions regarding this cheat sheet or what, we, what would you like to include on it, let me know because I'm preparing also the second page where there will be more JavaScript and jQuery snippets like loops and functions as well. And where do you get this GreenSock cheat sheet? It's very simple, go to my site, just search for GreenSock cheat sheet and you should see the blog post and the download link for the PNG or if you want the PDF. The PDF has an advantage that you can copy and paste from it and also the links are clickable to the right resources, okay? You might also find links throughout the GreenSock documentation. So wherever these links, it links directly to these blog posts, okay? So it's one place where you can stay up to date with this cheat sheet and with the new versions of it as well. Alrighty, so the URL is also in the comments under the video if you're watching on YouTube. And that's it all for today. Hope you liked it. Hope you find this green sock cheat sheet useful. And if you want to get more useful stuff from the guy who hates tomatoes but loves front-end development, subscribe to the channel, like the video or leave a simple comment about this green sock cheat sheet, okay? Until next time, happy tweening, bye.